Hello, hello. Welcome to the City of Healing, where the city resides within. Hope everyone is doing well. Good morning. Good morning. I uh, wanted to come forth briefly to um, share a brief short story about a little bit about my life. Um, my nickname um, for uh, a long time, especially when I was in college, my first college was uh, Shine. And that name was given to me by one of my uh, employers uh, that I used to work for. And basically, I guess she used to recruit young people um, to model. And um, basically, I guess if you were skinny or you had something different or special about you, she just approached people in the mall and asked them to work for her. So that's what I did. One of my jobs when I was in my early 20s was modeling clothes and we get we got to keep some of the clothes and got a little money as well and got to travel a little bit and um this particular job i really liked it like i said because i like clothes but something really um stood out that she said to me one time and she said um she said don't smile and uh, don't show your personality just model the clothes and I thought to myself, she used to tell uh, one of the other uh, young ladies uh, to um, smile and, and you know, show herself, et cetera, et cetera. But for me, she told me not to smile, not to show my personality. And, um, and I thought, you know, that was part of what modeling was, is showing yourself. But I took that as, you know, she didn't really think that I was pretty enough to actually smile and show my personality but my nickname was shine because you know when i look back yesterday well not yesterday but a few weeks ago when i was with my at my aunt's house at some of my pictures i noticed how bright and shiny my eyes were and then sometimes now they get like that and some people wonder like how do you get your eyes to shine i was like i don't know they just do sometimes and um especially i guess if i'm happy and doing things that i like they do that but anyway um going back to that story i was uh took it personally and i feel at the time that it dimmed my light a little bit on the inside but you know back then you don't know about um the law of attraction and um uh sending yourself positive affirmations you don't have those types of tools especially when you didn't really grow up in a um, uh, um, a strong strong um, foundation where people know to give you positive affirmations and things like that but anyway um, like I said they put a little damper on me and then uh, going on further I remember having a, a conversation with a prominent male figure in my life and uh, he's like, what else are you going to do if this doctor thing doesn't work out? I said, well, I want to be Miss America. And uh, he said, well, don't be surprised if that don't work, you know. <laughs> and at the time, I was like, what? Did he really say that? And now it's like kind of funny. But anyway, uh, I, did, I took it to heart and I felt that that dimmed my light a little bit, too. And so going forward also, you know, I was in one of my first, my first real relationship with a guy and uh, it was a very um, great relationship in that relationship for four years in college. And uh, he was a very nice looking guy. And I always said, you know, why did you choose me? Why not another girl? Why, what do you like most about me? He said, well, I didn't want to be in a relationship with someone that's real pretty because then they'll get all attention. And I was like, wait a minute, wait a minute. So are you telling me that I'm not pretty? And he's like, oh, no, I didn't mean it that way. I was like, well, you said it now, so <laughs> I got this. But anyway, needless to say, even though I was in that relationship for a long time and uh, he made up for it, it didn't work out. And then going forward, you know, in another prominent relationship that I was in, um, I was telling him about what the other prominent person in my life told me. Uh, and he said, well, he got a point, you know. Um, 
I'll support you 100%, you know, with this Miss America thing, if you're serious. But don't be surprised if it don't work. I was like, what? I was like, wow, people don't give you the support that you want with your dreams, even though I wasn't really serious, serious about it. But, you know, uh, getting a lot of... Um, negative feedback from different people and then you go to prominent male figures for support and encouragement and then that's what you get it kind of dims your light a little bit but now that i know what i know about um feeding yourself and letting your own light shine it's um a, a brighter day and what people say or don't say to me uh, doesn't affect uh, my light Anyway, I just wanted to come forth and share that and encourage you to let your light shine brightly. And that's what I'll continue to do. Um, my eyes don't look like they used to look. Um, at times, they do. But I'm working on rekindling that fire within and letting my light shine brightly. Anyway, I hope you all have a blessed day. Thanks for listening. Take care.